Hello, welcome back to another beer review with your host Jonathan Brown and this little girl here. We are going to Poland. We are going to um, actually our story. I picked this up at the corner shop near where I work, and it's in a battered state. So you know, he's, he's kind of charging about fifty pence a can or something. I can't remember what it was. So we got a Polish beer. It's Tatra. There you go, boys and girls. 6% ABV, had to do a little bit of research on this, apparently they do quite a few different types of beer. Um, this one I think is owned, excuse me, by um, Ziviek Breweries, this brewer. Um, a lot of Polish uh, breweries are owned by the big concerns and stuff like that. So, I'm going to crack her open, if she doesn't disturb me. Aren't you? You're going to disturb me? You're going to stay there and be a good girl. So let's crack her open, like we do. It smells like a generic lager wood, if you know what I mean. That generic lager smell. That type of smell when you're in a town centre somewhere, you're walking past a bar early in the morning and you get that you get that kind of stale beer smell, you know, that kind of thing going on, if you know what I mean. So, let's pour out, um, as I said, it's a bit of a steak this can, but, you know, and there she is, pale looking, very pale looking, got cat ears all over the place, thanks to you. Uh, very pale looking lager, I would say that's more urine colour than anything else, 6% six, six, six like I said, very off putting white head to this, it's kind of like looks like a very, what's the word, sometimes white heads for me when I look at a beer, they don't look very appetising, it doesn't make me want to kind of like tuck into it because I don't know they just look off-putting artificial you know what I mean yeah so there you go it says product of Poland a lot of Polish beers I've had I've really enjoyed I'm hoping this is be a good one to carry on with the you know to carry on with the pattern the trend should I say of Polish beers because I haven't had a duff one really so cheers, I'm going to go in. First off, it feels thin. It's 6%. It feels thin. There's a slight... Like, um, feels like something's been boiled. It feels like it feels there's a lot of carbonation in the mouth. It feels there's no, there's nothing really kind of like um, giving me a nice, pleasant drinking experience. If you know what I mean, it doesn't feel. It's something like a, I can't put my finger on it, it's something which I don't really like about this one. I don't know if it's the amount of carbonation in this. Here's a bready note there. There's a cereal note there, a wheat note there. Um, it feels very thin um, in, in taste, as I said. It feels a bit... What's the word? It feels a bit... Soulless. That's the word. Soulless. There's really nothing much to say about this. 
it's a beer, lots of carbonation, soulless in taste, there's nothing there that says wow, it's enjoyable, it's nothing like say an Okichim, there's nothing there even like um, the Tisky, there's nothing there to it and it's a big disappointment to me. So I'm going to keep this one short and sweet, one more time. Nah, nothing to it. Carbonated, malty, that's it. Tatra, give it a whirl. Not a fan of that one, that's the first stuff Polish beer I've had. Rubbish. Thanks for watching. See you boys and girls on my next one. So cheers.